Hey, what's up? It's James Kirkland, a.k.a. Community Kirk. Concerned about the community and trying to create connections and community to cure its chasms. Listen, one of my favorite songs is a song by John Mayer that's entitled Waiting on the World to Change. Now, some of the lyrics of the song uh, include, it says, uh, it's hard to beat the system when you're standing at a distance, but I'll keep waiting, waiting on the world to change. And like John Mayer, I too am waiting on the world to change. But I wonder what it is, what's it going to take? I was on Facebook yesterday and I had a status out and I asked a question and one of my friends, uh, he said it was a loaded question, but I asked him what was it going to take to make the world change? Well, I think one of the things that it's going to take to make the world change is that we need to learn as a people to practice collective efficacy. The term collective efficacy, uh, it means uh, knowing your neighbor and being willing to act on their behalf. Understand that we of Amer African American descent or African descent come from people who are communal by nature. Communal means that we are, that means it takes a village to raise a child. In other words, uh, we know that the whole village in, is involved in the raising process. Uh, you remember a time back in the day where uh, if you messed up down the street, you'll get a whooping while you were down the street. Then they would call your mama. Your mama would whoop you when you got home because the whole community took an active part in raising our children and making sure what was going on in the community. Uh, but with some of the things that have been instituted over the last several years, uh, uh, we've we've really lost sight of what it means to have strong African American communities, and many of the communities have become somewhat disadvantaged. But what we got to do is we got to work together to begin to do some things to begin to activate and actuate change that is necessary in our communities. Listen, I'm Community Kirk, and I'm going to be coming to you from time to time talking about different subject matters that I believe will help to better our communities. Now I'm getting ready to go, and I'll see you later. But remember this: the world is changing. Why do you remain the same?